Hello everybody, I'm Razor444. Welcome to It Moves. And I have been waiting for this game for so long. <laughs> um I did the demo of the game, it's on my channel, you can check it out. So if you run into any parts where the dude has to tell the story and all that, I'm probably going to, you know, get through it pretty quickly, you know, not really read it that much because I already know the story. But if you would like to know more in depth the story and hear me read, <laughs> you can always click. Oh, sorry. You can always click on uh, my link in the description to my demo of the game. Which describes so much in, in detail and just like it's a creepypasta game. And that's what this is based off of. And I'm so excited to play the full version. It just came out. So let's go. New game. This brightness of the lift bar on the TV screen blends into the background and the center bar is hardly fair. How do I do the brightness? How do I do it? It doesn't seem to be working. Okay, well, I guess we're just gonna do all that now, aren't we? Bedtime's supposed to be a good event for a child. Yeah, I've already read that. This is me. Alright, let's go. I cannot prove that what happened to me was objectively real, but I can swear that what I experienced was genuine horror. I fear which, in my life, I'm glad to say, has never been equaled. I will relate it to you all now as best I can. Make of it what you will. But I'll be glad to just get it off my chest. Alright. Hello, Dad. What's up? And my father. What's up? Hey, Mom! How's it going? Yeah! This is my mother. Yeah! Why don't you go to bed? Okay! Sure, Mom! I don't want to touch Mom's naughty stuff. Oh, what could that bitch be hiding? Oh, it's my brother's room. I was eight years old at the time. And until then, I had shared a room quite happily with my older brother. Well, you know, he's older now, and if you know what I mean, guys kind of need their own room when they're a teenager. It just happens to be that way. Alright, let's go. Come on. Yeah, everyone needs their sleep. Ha ha ha. Except you're gonna die. <laughs> oh, sorry. Huh. Good night, mommy. Good night. <laughs> Chapter 1 The Cave Yes I don't think that was in the original Is this different? This might be different Is this different? Who are you? I can't talk to you, that's right God, I, I hope that They really changed Like or made it a lot longer than it was for the... I wonder what's cooking. Probably just some human flesh and... Oh, the fucking painting moved! Let's go down. I don't want to stay with Mr. Oz over here just staring at my ass. God. Oh god. Oh god. What? What? Oh, no. Get the fuck out. We're leaving. I don't care what precious minerals are around here, we're gone. We are gone. Oh shit! Good thing we kept running! Good thing we kept running! Oh shit. Is this the way to go? No. Don't kill me. Oh! Oh! God! What are you? You're like a circle face thingy. Oh. I get that. Uh, what moves that one? Wait, what? Oh. Yeah, there we go. 
There we go. Pretty simple. Hey. Let's go. Let's go. Let's keep going. I want to get by the part. Oh shit. All right, I want to get by the part that I've already played and get to the actual new shit. Like I said, if you guys want to learn, like, what they're saying, and if I'm not going too fast or whatever, you can always, like, I mean, I guess you might be able to pause it, but I have been- OH SHIT! RUN, MOTHERFUCKER! RUN! WHY ARE YOU NOT RUNNING? WHY ARE YOU NOT RUNNING FROM THAT? NO! GOD DAMN IT! Well, you guys, I think I'm dead. Did I die? Did I really die? I'm gonna be mad if I really died. I'm really gonna be mad. Oh no, I didn't. Mom, I had a bad dream. Oh god, mom. Oh god. You just don't know. Shut up. Shut up the fuck up. You don't know what it's like to be me. Shut up, mom. Get the fuck up. Get the fuck up. Why do they have the dude from, you know, the weatherman, uh, Will Ferrell, uh, fuck, I forgot the name of the game. Why do they have a poster of that? You know, whatever. Oh, come on, I'll be up in a minute. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, guys, I'm skipping it because I've already freaking read it. So, yeah. Where do you want me to go? Back in here? Oh, is that already nighttime again? Oh, another day. Okay. Yeah, I had a bad time with the friends and all that. School sucked dick. I don't blame them. School did suck dick. I hated school more than like anything. Sorry, my nose is running, you guys. I don't have any tissues around here. I would freaking use that. Something startled me in the night. Oh no. Chapter 2, Labyrinth. Alright. Sounds fun. We're going through the game pretty quick. Because I already know what I'm doing. <laughs> okay. Oh shit. I don't gotta show my whole fucking computer screen every time I get something wrong. Damn. I forgot this. Damn it! It's always the last one. It's always the last one. I bet you it's. Yeah! God damn! It was so happy. It was like, yeah, you can do this. You can do this. Yeah, no. No, you can't. Alright, so let's. If I remember correctly, I need to go down here first. If I remember, if my memory is correct, I need to go down here and unlock shit. Just moving on along here. Oh, there's one. Oh shit! That's all right. That's that thing shows up on my fucking screen. That motherfucker. Nobody likes you, sir. Nobody likes you. I sure as fuck don't like you on my screen. And I'm sure no one else does either. If you guys can't tell, there's a big, huge screen. Not huge screen. There's a big, huge face on my screen. So if you, like, zoom out here and look at that motherfucker. He's just right there. He's like smiling. He's Darth Maul and he's a fucking scary son of a bitch. Give me your doll. Yeah, I want to see your full face. I want to see your full face. I want to touch it. I want to touch your face. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm sure. Oh, God. I'm sure you would like that, wouldn't you? I'm sure you would. <laughs> You're in your crazy fucking face. I don't know. 
where the last one is. I think it's down here because I haven't been down here. Do you guys see it? God, just get him off my fucking screen, please. God, even though I played this not long ago, the demo, this is still horrifying. I didn't want to do this again. Oh, God. Oh, whoa. Whoa, buddy. Whoa. We just met, okay? Would, would, you, would you just calm down? You awake from a deep sleep to something moving or stirring. It must be the cat. Yeah, we know. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. He just pretty much tells the story. Because it is a creepy pasta story. And the story is very good. So if you guys really want to learn, you know, I already know what he's saying because, you know, I made the video, I've already played it. And it wasn't that long ago, so I do remember everything. It's just, I don't want to read it again and waste time. So. So if you guys really want to see me read it and narrate and all that, uh, Please, please, please click on the description below to learn all what's going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, the bedroom, oh god, there's someone under my bed. Oh, mom said there wasn't, but I know there was. Oh, I know the truth. Oh god. Oh. Oh. If I saw that staring at me from outside, I would not be fucking happy. I'd be like, oh god, I'm doomed for existence. Oh, fuck. Just fuck it. Just, just get away from me. Oh, god damn, go! Would you hurry up? Chapter 3, fix your eyes! Factory you raise. Let's go. Yeah, I know. You just keep getting more and more creepy as we go. Cause you're a bitch. You're a real bitch. And I said bitch. Oh, you, you sir, have done very good for your looks. You really have. Like I say, guys, I've already played that part, so... Some of it don't scare me, but that face scared the shit out of me. I don't care who you are, that face just looking at you continuously till you complete something is not very fun. That... Well, actually, it is fun. <laughs> I, I need to reword that. That's not very, uh... Happiness. It's really creepy and disturbing and if you're like me you like that kind of stuff isn't there a isn't there a lever here okay I guess not I like how everything's factorized fact factorized factory eyes like uh Oh god, hello. Uh, oh god. Oh god, I wish I could remember which way you open shit. I forgot. Not that way. I'm gonna try to hurry through this as fast as I can for you guys. So don't worry, I'll be done very soon, and I'll have some very cool commentary if you want to stick around and watch. Oh shit! I forgot about you! I forgot about you! I forgot about you, you bitch! You motherfucker! No! Oh god, can I click that? Okay, I think it's over here. I think it's over, yeah. Oh no? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Oh god! What the fuck is this shit? I don't remember this! 
I don't want any. Please go away. Go away, bitch. Go away. I don't like you. Ah. What the fuck is that? What? What is that? A creepy mask. That definitely was not there before. I don't care what anybody says, that was not there before. Okay, it might have been. But, I don't remember it. Alright, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, damn it. It's the other way. This way. No, oh, I've already been in there. Yeah, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. What? Oh, this way. Okay. Ugh. 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 Get away from me. Oh, God. I knew it was a bad idea. I knew it was a bad idea. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to disturb you in your pile of deadness. Uh, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know what to say. I'm at a loss for words for that shit. Uh, I don't want to let you out. You are so creepy. I don't <laughs> Oh, what's this? Okay. Heard that. Is it down here? <gasps> it was! Oh god, the thing's out. The thing is out. Oh no. No, 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 no. No, 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 so this is the end of the demo. Oh wait a minute, first you gotta read this shit. Not shit, it's actually a great story. I'm not even joking. Then with great force, I prodded angrily between two slats into the mattress. Even though the padding, it felt as though someone had viciously stuck their fingers into my side. I let out an almighty cry and the wheezing and shaking and moving thing in the bunk below replied in kind by violently vibrating the bunk as it had done the night before. Small flakes of pain powered onto my blanket from the wall as a frame on the bed scraped along it backwards and forwards. Once again I was bathed in light and there stood my mother, loving caring as she always was, the comforting hug and calling words which eventually subdued my hysteria. Of course she asked what was wrong, I cannot say, I dared not say, I simply said one word over and over again. Nightmare. <gasps> this patterned, pattern of events continued for weeks, if not months. Night after night, I would awaken to the sound of rustling sheets. Each time, I would scream so as to not provide the, this abomination with the time to prod and feel for me. With each cry, the bed would shake violently, stopping with the arrival of my mother, who would spend the rest of the night in the bottom bunk. Uh, seemingly unaware of the sinister force torturing her son nightly, along the way I managed to f uh, feign illness, a few items, and come up with other less than truthful reasons for sleeping in my parents' bed. But more than often than not, I would be alone for the first few hours of each night in that place, the room where the light from the outside did not sit right, alone with that thing. The time you can become desensitized to almost anything, no matter how horrific. I had come to the realization that, for whatever reason, this thing could not harm me when my mother was present. I am sure the same would have been said for my father, but as loving as he was, waking him from sleep was almost impossible. Waking me, on the other hand, was not trouble at all, thanks to the nightmares. Why'd you show my desktop there for a second? Yes! It continues! 
Yeah! For a second I was like, is this just the demo again? <laughs> but no, it's not. This is new shit. Yes! You guys, this is new. This is new. It's new! Oh my god, I'm so excited. Oh my god. But I don't know anything that's gonna happen, so we gotta read all the shit now. Alright. Paint glass to pick some religious man, I guess. A hook hangs from the wall. A piece of meat hangs to dry from it. Ugh. 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 Wait. Okay. Earthquake. I guess. Paint glass to pick some religious man, I guess. You guys, I'm sorry, but this game is so damn scary for an RPG Maker game. Not often can RPG Maker game be scary. Uh, you know, I played The Idiot and all, and those were great games, but, you know, they, they weren't scary. And scary is so hard to do in an RPG Maker game, especially like this. And I am so happy I'm playing it! Yes! Alright, let's go. Continue on. I'm sorry, I just had to say thank you so much for believing in me, you guys, and, you know, making it to where I can make these videos for you guys. It means so much to me. And, uh, if you guys ever want me to stream, I mean, I, I don't have the money right now, but if I did, I, I would, and... I would do charity events, and not only that, I would also, uh, you know, try to have events to where I could raise money for myself to make my channel better, to where, you know, charity events would make so much more money, and that's my goal, that's what I want to do, I want to give to charity, I want to help people, and uh, every single YouTuber that is new and has contacted me. I've never once, not once, didn't respond. So, you can always say that. I've always tried to help everybody. I can't say that for the future, but, you know, as long as I can, I will help whoever. But, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and let's continue on, because I'm really into this story, and let's go. The painted glass depicts a scene from the Bible. So we're in like a church. Oh god, that was creepy. They're doing things in in RPG Maker games that I never thought could be done. Oh, there's a big spider. No, 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 no. Hello? Hello? Oh god, I don't like it. I don't like it. Get away. Get away, get away, get away, get away. Disgusting stuff. Yeah, no shit. Is that like baby heads? What's with the earthquakes? That's weird. What the fuck? That looks so cool. Oh my god. You guys, I'm sorry. This game is showing me so much stuff that RPG Maker games can do. It's just they put in the work to do it. This is insane. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I'm just so... I, I'm, I'm like a freaking fangirl. All like, oh, it's... <laughs> Yeah. Alright, I mean, I'm freaking out here because I I've never seen anything like this. I really haven't. Standing in front of a car, blah, blah, blah. The spider that lives in this nest is nowhere to be seen. Well, good. I don't want it to be seen. I hate spiders more than anything. I'm serious, too. I would rather... Snakes don't even bother me, to be honest. Like, a snake? I could, like, walk up to it, and like, I would literally grab it. It don't bother me. What bothers me is spiders. That's... To be honest with you, that's really the only thing that really scares me in real life. I mean, like, of course, if someone jumps out at me for a second, it scares me. But besides that, uh, nothing really scares me. 
scares me in real life. Uh, except for spiders. I'm really freaking scared of them. If there's one, like, in the, like, tub or in the shower or whatever, I, I can't kill it. I just can't. It freaks me out. Oh, God. It freaks me out so bad that I have to get my aunt or someone to kill it because I'm not going to do it. So if you're ever married to me, which I ever doubt I will be. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But if I ever am, uh, please know that I am scared of spiders. You will have to kill it. Not me. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Quit showing my desktop. Everyone gets to see that I use really awesome stuff. That's all, <laughs> That's all I can say. <laughs> okay. Uh, 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 uh. Oh god. Ah! I never knew these games could do that! Oh my god. Uh, uh. Oh, you are fucked up. He's gonna kill me. He's gonna kill me. <laughs> oh no, it's a fucking alien! Go! You can live in a fucking alien! Oh, we're through it again! It's gonna be you, isn't it? It's gonna be you! It's not gonna be you. I don't know if I trust you. It's gonna be him. It's gonna be him! Oh! Alien! Okay! Oh god damn it! No! No! Why? Ah! 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 God damn it! What? They're not doing anything! Oh, uh, alien, why is your mouth open? Ah! Uh, uh, do I need to go up to him? You are making noises, sir. I don't like it. I don't like it. Uh, 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 oh, God. It's this one. It's this one. You are the true fucker. Get away from me. Times I gotta go through this hell. This is like Silent Hill PT. Oh shit! I want a PS4 so bad so I can show you guys Silent Hill PT. I really do. Uh, oh shit! Oh shit! No! 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 Take your baby friend! Take your baby friend on me! Take your baby friend on me! No. No. God, you guys, I'm like clenching my teeth and shit. Oh my god. Nothing has done this to me since like, oh my god. I mean, I think the last thing I did it was like five nights at Freddy's. But that was only like the first or second night. My greatest fears were realized in the winter. The days grew short, and the longer nights merely provided the rich with more opportunities. It was a difficult time for my family. My grandmother, a wonderfully kind and gentle woman, had deteriorated greatly since the death of my grandfather. My mother was trying her best to keep her in the community as long as possible. However, dementia is a cruel and degenerative illness, robbing a person of their memories one day at a time. Soon she recognized none of us, and it became clear that she would need to be moved from her house to a nursing home. Before she could be moved, my grandmother had a particularly difficult few nights with my mother decided but when and my mother decided that she would stay with her. As much as I love my grandmother and felt nothing but anguish for her illness, to this day I feel guilty that my first thoughts were not of her, but of what the nightly visitor may do. It become aware of my mother's absence. 
her presence being the one thing which I was sure was protecting me from the full horror of this thing's reach. I rushed home from school that day, immediately wrenched the bed sheets and mattress from my lower bunk, removing all the slats and placing an old desk, a chest of drawers, and some chairs which he kept in a cupboard where the bottom bunk used to be. I told my father I was making an office, which he found adorable, but I would be damned if I'd give that thing a place to sleep for one more night. As darkness approached, I lay there knowing my mother was not in the house. I did not know what to do. My only impulse was to sneak into her jewelry box and take a small family crucifix which had been seen there before. While my family were not very religious, and that age I still believed in God and hoped that somehow this would protect me. Although fearful and anxious, while gripping the crucifix under my pillow tightly in one hand, sleep eventually came, and I drifted off to dream. I hope it. Uh, I hope that I would awaken in the morning without incident. Unfortunately, the night was the most terrifying of all. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! 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 Oh no 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 How about no How about no Yeah I'll save it I would love to save it I don't wanna do it I don't want it Anyway I have to go. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. This one's a little long, but uh, I wanted to get through the first part because uh, I already read it. But like I said, there'll be a link in the description for those of you who want to see and fully understand the first part of the game. Uh, I mean, it did pretty good at just describing it with me skipping it and all that. I mean, you still got the gist of what's going on. It just went into more detail. But it wasn't nothing. You didn't. You guys didn't miss anything. Let me put it that way. But you can check out my first video if you want and uh, see me get really freaked out. But uh, I'm pretty freaked out right now too, so it don't really matter. But anyway, I'll see you guys in just a second because I'm about to record this right now as soon as I end this video. But uh, this one's got to end now, so I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.